an unusual, circular dance of tropical typhoons known as the Fujiwara effect will happen in the Western Pacific, as well as in the Eastern Pacific Basin later this week, producing high surf along the Southern California Drift. At this moment, there's a trio of named storms in the Eastern Pacific Ocean, west of Mexico. The easternmost combine, hurricanes Hillary and Irwin, will keep pushing toward the west-northwest through Wednesday, the Weather Channel reports. According to a Japanese researcher who depicts Fujiwara effect in early 1920s suggests Fujiwara effect details how do tropical cyclones 800 to 900 miles apart rotate counterclockwise about one another. Think of the teacup ride at Disney or the tilt-a-whirl at your local county fair, but with tropical systems instead. For this situation, Irwin, the westernmost tempest of the pair, will, in the long run, get pulled quickly east, at that point north and ingested by the course of Hillary this end of the week, as per the most recent gauge direction. Commonly, the more grounded tempest will rule the weaker either failing it or converging with it out and out. For this situation, Hillary anticipated that would be the more serious sea tempest, will probably be the survivor, with Irwin pivoting about it like a planet's moon, at that point fails. This whole procedure from catching Irwin to circling Hillary's east and north sides, to ingesting it could last four to five days add up to. Reports suggest higher swells may achieve the Southern California drift when late Thursday or Friday, proceeding into the end of the week. Shoreline disintegration and seaside flooding are conceivable, especially on southbound shorelines, as per the National Weather Service. More than 5,000 miles away, Typhoon Naura, the main storm of 2017, is collaborating with another tropical tornado named Culep in a different Fujiwara impact. 